Hey everyone, I'm in the park today. I was uh, taking a walk after doing my yoga and uh, reflecting on some things. And I wanted to talk to you all about what I realized on my walk today uh, is by far the greatest thing that anyone can aspire to be. Um, this is something that's taken me a really long time to realize, and now that I've realized it, uh, I don't think I can ever go back. It's one of those thoughts. Anyways, so, in my opinion, the greatest thing that anyone can be is a child. Now, when I say child, what I mean is not someone under the age of 18. When I say adult, what I mean is not someone over the age of 18. When I say that the greatest thing that you can be a child is just this. Anyone in my life that I've met that was childlike are the happiest most interesting, most alive, exuberant, joyful, loving people I've ever met. And anyone that I've met that was adult-like is the most boring, empty, shallow, insufferable people that I've ever met. The people in my life that were adults that I knew that have become more childlike over time I like them more now than I've ever liked them and they like themselves more now than they've ever liked themselves and it's clear to see that everything about their life has gotten better sorry I had to pause the video because uh, some people were walking by and I didn't want to interrupt their conversation with my weird YouTube video. Um, but anyways, so the adults in my life that I've seen become more childlike have all universally seemed a lot more happy with their lives. But the children in my life, the childlike people that have become adults, are all lost. They don't know who they are anymore. They don't know what they want anymore. They don't know what's good for them anymore. They don't do what's good for them anymore. Life for them has become a pointless drudgery. A point A to point B that they don't desire to actually journey through. It's the children in the world that are what make the world worth living. It's the adults in the world that make life hell. And to the degree that you can re retain a certain childlike quality within yourself, you're never alone. And everything is a new opportunity. Everything is a place for creativity and imagination to take place. For you to find yourself anywhere doing anything. But when you have an adult-like quality inside of yourself, everything is dead serious. Everything is formulas. That you have to fulfill. There's no emotion in it. There's no passion in it. It's just living. And I think what I've realized today on this walk is I turn 29 tomorrow. It'll be my last year in my 20s. And unfortunately, uh, 
Unfortunately, I spent my 20s trying to be an adult. When there was nothing wrong with me. There was nothing wrong with me growing up and I didn't need to change. But I thought I did. So, I wasted my 20s. This will be the final year 2025, the year after, the year that this is posted, this will be the final year that I recognize myself as an adult, because from this point forward, I'm done. I think I would genuinely rather be dead than be an adult for the rest of my life, having only adult relationships with people, doing only adult things only caring about things in an adult way, only doing things in an adult way. I... I've played that game now. And I'm done. There is no point in it. No one needs to try it out. It's not worth it. It's literally worth dying more than it is worth becoming an adult so I'm done. Now, I can't revert and regress back into what I was like when I was a child. That doesn't mean I can't become a child again. Because again, a child is not someone under the age of 18, and an adult is not someone over the age of 18. We're not talking age of consent laws here, okay? Get your head out of the gutter. We're not talking about that. We're talking about humanity. We're talking about attitude towards life. You can have a joyful attitude towards life. You can have a humorous attitude towards life. You can be creative. You can be imaginative. You can wake up every morning and say to yourself, I'm going to have the best day that I can possibly have, and nothing's going to stop me. That's childlike. Or... You can wake up and say to yourself, I'm going to do whatever it is that I need to survive today and nothing more. Because to do anything more would be inefficient and possibly dangerous. That's the only difference between a child and an adult. That's all there is. Either you're cowering in safety and survival or you're living. And children are alive. Adults are just killing themselves slowly. That's all there is. So, I'm abandoning this adult way of life. And I'm going to return to the way I was before when I knew what I wanted. When nothing could stop me. When the world was something to be enjoyed. Not survived. Because no one's going to survive this. One day, every one of us will be gone. And in the final moments, what will matter most to us? Did we live the way we wanted? Or did we live some other way? I choose to live the way I want. And it will kill me but at least I will die doing what I want. There's two kinds of people in this world, a child and an adult. What do you want to be?